voters across Cal Land have just a few hours left to cast their ballots. While a majority of today's races are for the Republican primary, all voters, regardless of party registration, can decide on Constitutional Amendment C. Cal Land's Don Jorgensen caught up with a few voters to find out what's on their minds and what inspired them to cast their ballots. Well, Tom and Angela, from the economy to record high gas prices to abortion, there are a lot of issues weighing heavily on the minds of voters. A lot of parents brought their kids with them to the ballot boxes today. And you don't. I'm trying to set a good example on using the right to vote. Including Kelly Ebison, who wants her children to understand the importance of voting. I hope they get an engagement in the process and, and want to study the important issues facing America so they can make informed, proper decisions to guide our country moving forward. Her son, Evan, who is a sixth grader, understands. He says people fought for our freedoms, and that's why it's important to exercise your right to vote. It's like if you bought, if your parents bought you something very expensive and you never used it, you probably should use it because they worked very hard for that. Amendment C is also on the ballot. If it passes, it would increase the percentage to raise taxes in South Dakota from a simple majority to 60 percent. And some voters we talk with don't like that. And much like we decide all of our other elections for candidates by a simple majority, I believe that we should decide other items such as increasing taxes by the same same amount. We should not have a higher threshold for that. Jill Schuneman has voted in every election since she was 18 and didn't want to miss this one either. The country is changing and people are so polarized that we have to vote to get our country back the way it used to be. It's changing and it's not necessarily all good. And there's still time to cash your ballot. The polls close at 7 o'clock local time tonight.